I can't believe we have been blessed with 30 years of Festival Flamenco right here in Albuquerque, New Mexico. This is, you know, just almost unprecedented to have this kind of a festival uh, go on for 30 years. The colors, the sights, the sounds, the dancers from Spain, it is fantastic. We are the center of flamenco in the United States. And this week, we will be the center of flamenco for the world. We are so fortunate in this community to have world-class dancers, singers, musicians from Spain come and share their incredible talent here with us. The value of Festival Flamenco is unprecedented. It's like the superhero of cultural events. Basically, the dancers that come from all over the world to dance in the festival are like superheroes. They're like gods that come down from Mount Olympus, and we experience joy and sorrow and elation through them. The shows during festival are really important for me to see because just watching the way they dance and the way the passion flows through them and the way they play with the audience and the way they use the stage is really important for me as a performer. I'm going to all the shows this year for the first time because I fundraised with the Youth Fundraising Council to get a ticket package. And that was really exciting because our community raised the money for about 17 of us youth to go see the shows. It's very important for UNM to play a role in helping uh, produce the festival because the educational value of the festival is, is very high, not only for the flamenco students, but for people that are studying other dance forms as well. Students that have never been to a professional flamenco show, that may never even get a chance to go to Spain, have it here. And when they come to the festival, they can see these performances, and that in turn will allow them to talk to their families and their friends throughout the country and throughout the world and talk to them about the amazing things that happen in Albuquerque. I think it's important that flamenco grows and expands because it's like an amazing culture. The key thing about flamenco is that it retains and sustains the, the culture, the Spanish culture, which has been here for centuries and centuries. My um, very first memories of the festival were seeing shows in Pope Joy Hall. We now have this beautiful tablao that we're in. Um, the National Hispanic Cultural Center, of course, has played a big part in the festival. So the growth that I've seen in the university and the partnerships with um, Heritage Hotels and the Hispanic Cultural Center has just been such a blessing. Each one of our hotels takes on a cultural partner and Hotel Albuquerque is so proud to have the Tablao in the space at Hotel Albuquerque. That way our guests come here and take this story of flamenco and our Spanish heritage with them all over the world. Globally we've seen more of a trend towards authentic experiences that touch on our cultural heritage and this event in particular brings this robust opportunity to have a really meaningful experience here in New Mexico. It is my utmost honor to congratulate. Congratulations. 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 Here's to another 30 years for all of us, and congratulations, Nasa Tuta Flamenco and the Ancinia's family. Ole. Ole Festival Flamenco. Ole. Ole Flamenco. Ole. Ole. Ole Flamenco. Ole. Ole. Ole Flamenco. Ole. 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 Ole Flamenco. Oh,